What's going on YouTube? Jelani from JelaniTheMarketer.com here, back again with another video. And in this video, guys, I'm going to be showing you how you can make money from YouTube without ever having to post a video. This is actually a funny story, so I'm going to tell you the story of uh, why I'm actually making this video. Uh, but before we get into that, definitely subscribe, hit that alert button so you know when I post a new video. And as always, if you have any comments or suggestions, leave those down below. I love to interact with you guys and talk with you. Um, so definitely leave those down below. All right, so let's get right into it. This is funny because I posted on March 8th on my personal Facebook page. I said, uh, hey guys, can you go spam this video and report it as stolen? I posted the link and I was like, they literally ripped my video, you know, and they're, you know, they're sharing it. They're doing their own thing with my own video. And it really annoyed me that they were doing that. Um, so I had my my people spam this this video and there were, there were uh, 84 comments and someone at the end of the thing said, um, you know, dude, you need to turn off your uh, Creative Commons license or turn on your your Creative Commons license. So basically saying like you have an option for people to go find videos that they could be reused because you have the Creative Commons, I guess, license on there, right? So you need to change it to the standard license. I had no idea that this was actually how people were able to steal it legally or steal my videos legally. Uh, so maybe you want to do some research on how people are using this method, how they're making money with this method. And I'm actually going to show you exactly um, the cool way to make money uh, without having to steal particularly people's content. Okay, so let's go ahead and go into YouTube right here. And on your screen, I put top 10 singers. Now, this is what you want to do. You want to go to YouTube. You want to find different videos that are really, really cool. They have a lot of views. As you can see, there's different uh, videos. This one has a million. Uh, it was posted, um, or sorry, it has 809,000 views. It was posted six months ago, so it would definitely hit a million views uh, with when the, with the year um, when the year comes, right? So by a year, it'll probably hit a million. But there's there's different ones. So let's go top ten in general, right? And the reason why you want to do top ten is because what we're going to be doing is we're going to be filtering based on the Creative Commons license, right? So what you want to do is you want to go to filter and this is how they were able to steal my video. I had no idea, but the more you know, start researching it and there's actually a way to make money and I'm going to show you that uh, in a second. So what you want to do is you just want to look at the top 10 things, right? So the top 10 scariest videos on the internet you shouldn't watch alone, right? Okay, so this video was posted an hour ago actually, which is funny. Uh, it has 6.7 thousand views. Um, so we, we want to look for things that are kind of old. This one, 2.1 million views one month ago top uh, top 10 scary things found frozen in Antarctica okay so this is pretty cool right um, and what these people are uh, essentially doing are they're going on the web they're finding videos that are cool uh, like what we're doing here and what they're doing is downloading the video so if you don't know how to download a video all you have to do is go to Google search how to download a YouTube video um, and then you're gonna cut up the video so you're gonna look at what scenes are really scary you're gonna look at what scenes are really good what scenes are really bad and then you're gonna make a compilation video okay so this is essentially what they're doing and this is how they're able to make money because what YouTube says is essentially you're making three dollars per 1,000 views okay so if you're making three dollars per 1,000 views and you have 2.1 million views you're making a lot of money per month right it's 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 just common sense math right and then once you have a channel that is, that has a video that has gone viral YouTube makes it easier for you to become a partner and then that's how you're able to actually run ads on that particular channel to make that three dollars per 1,000 uh, views, right? Okay, so hope that made sense, right? Once you download the video, you, like I said, you're gonna chop up the video. You can easily download a program. If you're on Mac, you can download ScreenFlow. If you're on PC, you can download Camtasia. Um, and I actually have a link for ScreenFlow down below, so you can click that and get access to ScreenFlow. So you can start downloading these videos, chop them up, and then make your own compilation video. Uh, and within that compilation video, you're just gonna segment the scenes that look really good. You don't have to even be on camera. You're just gonna get pick the scenes that look really good. You're gonna pick the scenes that not so good, so you don't include those um, but you want to pick the scenes that are really good that you can include in your uh, compilation video now once you have done that you want to make sure that you are making sure that you select Creative Commons in the filter okay so if I didn't say that before just make sure that once you are filtering it you select Creative Commons which will allow us to use videos that have that uh, particular license on the video okay so this is really really crucial otherwise you're gonna get in trouble with YouTube now the person that uh, stole my video uh, on your screen here you can see like I said I spammed it and I actually got the video taken down because I'm a partner and I reached out to YouTube I said hey you know this is a copyright claim um, even though I didn't have that particular standard license on my video I'm you know I was still able to get that video taken down so this is why you kind of want to do compilation videos it just makes it harder for the for YouTube or the person that is claiming the copyright claim uh, to say where that video came from right when you have like 10 different videos in sequence it's a little bit harder for that to go down and I know you're probably thinking well if you got it down why are you talking about this I'm talking about it because it's a really cool way to actually make money and I had no idea that this was even a thing and that people 
for doing this. So in my particular case, this person that stole my video, he literally just stole everything like he didn't change anything pretty much. So I would recommend you change things out. You don't want to just literally just take a video and re upload it and say it's your own. You want to make sure you're, you're doing something different on that particular video um, so that you can stand out when it comes to that copyright side of things. Uh, one good way to do that is add music to the background. So you can go into the YouTube studio creator and download free music from the YouTube platform and then just quickly download it. It takes like two seconds to find a track and then you upload to that particular video, keeps the engagement going and also uh, makes it different from the original videos that were found in the in, in the Creative Commons license area. Okay, so these all these videos are just top ten, right? So you can get really creative. You can even go into the trending section of YouTube and then look at what is trending for a particular thing. So let's say um, gaming is really hot, right? So these are the videos that are tr uh, trending for gaming. So what you would want to do <clears throat> at that point. Just look, all right, let's look at the different niches, right? As you can see, gaming obviously is really hot. Fortnite's really hot. So what we can do then, if this is a trending topic, we can go back and search uh, Fortnite, right? And then once we do that, we just want to filter that and then go by Creative Commons. And then we can see, all right, this video, we can just you know, chop these up. This has a thousand views, cut it up, see what scenes are good, uh, and then make our own type of thing from that particular, from these particular videos. Uh, and like I said, once you get partnered, then that's how you'll be able to make money and you run ads on your video. And then uh, at that point, you will be making that $3 per 1,000 views. It may take some time. Your first video probably won't not will not go viral. Um, it takes a lot to go viral, but there are tools to kind of help you out in that aspect but i'm not going to talk about that in today's video um if you want more info on that though you can click uh, make, make a comment down below if you want to get access to a video that actually talks about how you can increase your views um i have a really special tool that i, I use that not a lot of people know about so if you want to see that video comment down below all right so Essentially, you're just going to find videos that are trending. You're going to find videos that are popular. You know, look at niches that people are really, really interested in on YouTube, right? Slime, for example, is a huge niche that people just uh, like little kids love watching, right? Uh, hair products, right? Um, all these different niches. You just have to do a little bit of research in that regard. But once you find a niche that you think people would do well in, just search by Creative Commons and then you can find uh, different videos in that particular niche. And then you want to download different videos, make a compilation, and then boom, add some music and let it run. Um, and then watch your videos go uh, go up in, in views, right? One, one thing you have to make sure though in, for this particular method to make money with YouTube doing this type of thing is you have to have a good clickbaity title you have to have a good thumbnail right you, these are things that are going to get people to click on the video and then um once you get partnered you know they'll, they'll be clicking the ads but it's really important that your thumbnail stands out and that your title is something that people want to actually click on okay so this is really really crucial to this method success okay from the research that i've done honestly i have not this is a full disclaimer i haven't done this method myself but i've done research and it does work when you do this well okay so as long as you're not not really literally just taking someone else's video uploading it when you're making your own compilation adding music adding different things um, it, it will do well if you have a niche that is uh, tend to go viral right um, so with that in mind just make sure that you're taking notes on these particular things otherwise you're gonna have a less chance of doing it so when you do it more and more though and you have a channel that is uh, niche specific and you have different compilation videos and you know you are doing different things to kind of help increase the viewers that watch your video um, you know by the title and the thumbnail you're just gonna have more people checking out your channel and more people subscribing and then you can kind of go a brand based on those compilations in that particular niche okay um, and then once you actually do that you can also another way to this is a bonus you can actually include affiliate links in the uh, in the comments section right or the description of the video so not only you're making money from the ads that YouTube provides on the particular video but you can also be making money from affiliate links that you put in the actual videos description so when people see that if it goes viral and a lot of people are looking at something that's really hot and, and it's trendy right and people are looking at the video they click the ad or if they don't click the ad they have an opportunity to purchase via the description the affiliate link in the description all right so this is essentially how it works it's really really simple but it's a cool way to make money online um, and it doesn't take that much effort besides finding those videos like I said making it your own uh, because the Creative Commons license allows you to do that 
uh, just make it your own. Don't just steal someone else's video. Make it your own. Add some music. Make it a little bit different. Make a compilation, and then it would do well um, in that regard. Okay, guys. So um, let me know if you like this method. If you like videos like this, talking about kind of out of the box ways to make money online. This is. I thought it was pretty out of the box. I've never really thought people were doing this type of thing. But then I did some research, and it was like, whoa, this actually is really cool. And the you know it can work if you if you know what you're doing. Okay. So let me know in the comments uh, down below. And guys, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you have uh, if you haven't subscribed Subscribe, definitely subscribe hit that alert button follow me on instagram at july the marketer and check out my blog blog.julyinthemarketer.com thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video